Yeah. And, and we're live. Go, wait. Go, go. Start over. Start over. We're live! Oh, oh, welcome to SNN. Our stream box was turned off, so we're going to be starting over. And our HDMI cord was borrowed for graduation. So we will be only audio and pictures today. Today is Friday, June 13, 2016. No, it isn't. Oh, wait, did you see this? Today is a hot day, which means star <laughs> periods 2, 4, and 6. Yearbooks came out last week, so we're all distracted, apparently. Good morning, Skyhawks. SNN, yeah, uh, look at this. Today is June 13th, 2016. Oh, wow, it's our last Monday of the entire school year. Our last Monday in middle school. Yeah, thanks so much for helping me out. It's a, uh, what is it? It's a hot day, which means star periods 2, 4, and 6. We already mentioned this. Did you see this? Wait, what about this over here? I love the theme. And this cover is amazing. I can't keep my hands off the cover. The texture is indescribable. It's just new. Applause all around for your book this year. But then I'd have to take my hands off the book and applaud. So, hey. <laughs> you did a great job. Thanks for all your hard work and candid shots. Lots of hard work went into this. Shout out and thanks to Simran and Ella H. for their coverage of the Senior Walk last week. That was pretty cool. Four years, that'll be us. Yep. Sorry we missed you on Friday. Mr. Smith really, really likes to go old school, so sometimes he, well... It wasn't our fault. Nope, not at all. Our tech is working great. The audio is awesome. But in all fairness, today is Blame Someone Else Day. But we're back today. Look at the picture. What's wrong with what we just said? And bonus question. What's the award given for excellence in theater? Like the Grammy for music, but this is for excellence in theater. Call 78293 with your answers ready. Go. Go. Want to keep your parents from freaking out? Start by returning your past due library books. Otherwise, charges will have to be made to your Skyward account. Remember the L and LMC is for library. This place is not a bookstore. If you lost something, then it might be time to man up and pay for it rather than see it charged to your account. Let's say you're in the middle of a book and you want to keep it throughout the summer. Easy. Check out those books for summer. Here's Olivia, and she's all ready with her reusable bag, and she started the summer checkout process. I love that her shirt says hashtag bored. A solution? Well, read. You have today and tomorrow, even Wednesday if you don't take the bus, to complete your summer book shopping in the LMC. Books checked out for the summer will all have a due date of September 12th. Now this is from the Camus Public Library. Hi, my name is Ellen and I work at the Camus Public Library and I'm here to tell you about our summer reading program. We do it every year and once you've signed up for the program, which starts tomorrow, you'll have all summer long to read whatever you want, log your time and earn fabulous free prizes. You can read books from the public library, but you can also come here to your school library to do summer checkout. Any kind of reading counts, comics, m manga, co uh, magazines, audiobooks, anything you want will count for our summer reading program. You can earn fabulous prizes like sports tote bags and number one 
fingers and free passes to the Camas Pool, Lacamas Swim and Sport, Vega Gym, Sky Zone, which is the new trampoline gym, all kinds of fabulous prices. And because all of you are now in the teen summer reading program, you all are part of the raffle at the end of the summer. And at the raffle, we will be pulling names for free gift cards to Squeeze and Grind, Starbucks, we'll be giving away candy, books, all kinds of fantastic free prizes. Now, if you are a big reader, if you think, I've, I know the summer reading program and I can do it really fast because I read during breakfast, lunch, and dinner every day, you should still participate and log your time all summer long because at the end of the summer, the 10 teens who read the most out of all the teens in the whole program will each become a top 10 reader and they will each get a $10 gift certificate, gift certificate to Barnes and Noble. So, Come to the library or go to our website to sign up for the summer reading program starting tomorrow. Sign up anytime all summer long and you can get free prizes from the Camas Public Library. I'll see you there. Before we talk about sports, let's talk about the heap of stuff in Lost and Found. Lost and Found, there's really only three words to say. Claim your stuff. All remaining items will be donated after the last day of school. Sign up for fall sports now. Registration paperwork may be found on our website. Or in the athletic office. Eighth grade football starts August 17th. And sixth, seventh, and eighth grade girls cross country starts August 22nd. Fundraising efforts for Ecuador. We raised $1,122.58. Great job, Skyhawks. How about a little birthday song? Okay, let's do it. This is happy birthday for August babies. Here's the list. Happy, happy birthday, may all your dreams come true. Happy, happy birthday from s and to you. Hey! That's it. We did it. All the months of the year. That was something on our goal list this year. We want to do it again next year, but maybe with your own signatures. And maybe even a birthday picture. Let us know. There's an s and suggestion QR code on the s and wall in the hall. It will be open until Wednesday. Follow it to a form and tell us what suggestions you have for next year's s and We really appreciate your support this year, every year. Yeah, but we've had some bumps and lots of new things to learn. Now be careful with what we're about to show you next. It will instantly cause hunger pains. Possibly a little sugar rush. It's the most delicious day of the year. Especially if you love cupcakes. Cupcake Lover's Day is here and now. Feast on these images. But wait, there's more. Did you know cupcakes were first baked in teacups? The name is Cupcakes, so yeah, that makes sense. Apparently 770 million cupcakes were eaten in the U.S. in 2012. That same year, Sprinkles Bakery, the world's first cupcake-only bakery from Beverly Hills, developed a hole-in-the-wall ATM that dispenses cupcakes 24 hours a day. Here's a picture. It holds up to 600 fresh cupcakes at a time. Cupcakes have swept the culinary world in the last few years, and it's no wonder why. With cupcakes flavors ranging from the classic vanilla to deliciously sweet caramel apple to oddly savory jalapeno cheddar, there is a cupcake for everyone. A delicious idea, and here's the website, sprinkles.com. But if you want to make your own, here are some inspiring summer cupcake creations you could concoct. Are we baking you crazy with all the pictures? Look at this awesome Finding Nemo inspired cupcake. Hey Dory. Yes, Dory is due out on Thursday. It is the eagerly awaited sequel to the 2003 Pixar hit. Forgetful Dory, voiced by Ellen DeGeneres, teams up with Nemo and Marlin to find her parents. On a very serious note, yesterday there was a horrific mass shooting in Orlando, Florida. The Space Needles Pride Month flag is lowered to half staff in Seattle on Sunday, June 12th. 2016 in response to an early morning shooting that left 50 dead and 53 wounded. The incident is the worst in United States history. Our thoughts are with them today and in the coming days. Last up, the phone in. It's not really blame someone else day. That's for the first Friday the 13th of the year. So not a Monday the 13th. And the Tony goes to Antoinette Perry Award for Excellence in Theater, more commonly known for informally as the Tony Award, recognizes achievement in live Broadway theater. Good job to Mrs. Seward's class and G. Cooper's class. A treat and fake cash will be delivered to you after the show. That is the news for Skyridge Middle School. 
where hashtag you matter. Today's thought for Martin Luther King Jr. Hate cannot drive out hate. Only love can. Remember to follow the code, the sky code. Be safe. Be respectful. Be responsible. And be kind. This has been Logan. And Kayla. Have a great last Monday of the school year, Skyhawks. Also, Skyhawks, some members of the Skyridge flock are not coming back next year. Say thanks and send out your friends and teachers off with some good summer wishes. At this time, please stand for the pledge. Ready, begin.